Our very favorite BI tool, Tableau came up with a recent release, the Tableau 22.4. This is loaded with a lot of great features. And one of the important features this time is the introduction of a string function, which is the proper function. You can come to the Tableau website to know more about all of these new features. Hi everyone and welcome back to Techianshi. In this video on my channel, we are going to talk about the proper case, which is a string function. If you like this video, please don't forget to hit on the subscribe button. So let's get started. For this, our dataset is going to be a Spotify winner track audio feature data, for which I will leave the link in the description box. You can feel free to download this dataset from the Kaggle website. I am doing the same right now. Once you have this data, you will see that this has basically data from Spotify and about different popular albums and artists and also their genres. If I filter on this data for album, you can see some of this data is not in a proper case. Some letters are big, some are small and they are not following a specific uh, format. So that these three columns that I see need a proper formatting, which is the track, artist and album. So in this video, we'll go ahead and begin in the Tableau dashboard how you can start using a proper function. So first, let's go ahead and import our file, which is the text file. This is the columns that we have from this file. Here are all the columns, the album column. And let's go to a sheet now. If I pull the columns, the album column, the artist column, the genre column and also the track column onto my row shelf. I can clearly see that some of these strings over here need a proper casing. So let's go ahead and create our first calculated field and we'll call this as a proper case function for album. We'll write proper as a function and in the bracket we will use the field which is the album. This is the calculation which we have created for album will pull this onto the row shelf. You can see now that some of these values which are not in a proper case have been refined as well. Right? This is what we were expecting the proper case to return for us. Similarly, let's go ahead and create the calculated field for artist and also for track. So again, I'm going to use the proper function and pull in the field name which is the artist and click on OK. Now pull this particular field that I just created onto my row shelf. Let's go ahead and do the same for the track as well. So the proper track and we'll write the function proper and in brackets we'll specify the field which is track. Now pulling this on the row shelf again. You can see the values are now in the proper case as we expected them to be in. Right now in this situation where we have all the three fields done and they are all in proper cases, we can just go ahead and remove some of these fields that we are having on the row shelf, which is the album, the artist and the track. Now we are left with all the three album, artist and track in a properly formatted string function. If I bring in the artist popularity into my column shelf, I can see and sort this basis some of these values over here. Feel free to play around with your dashboard and make sure that you are able to create something that's always insightful. Now when I have all of these in the proper case, I think we are good with our dashboard. So this is what we learned today is how to use a proper case using a string function in Tableau. If you like this video, please don't forget to hit on the subscribe button. And if this has been of any help, do let me know your comments in the feedback. I'm always happy to connect with you. So please reach out. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.